Hello y'all, this is Brushfire Windragon, and welcome back to TikTok, A Tale for Two. Now I think Broha and I left off about here. Hmm. So I guess noon would be up. So, up, right, up, maybe your one goes first, so up, right, up, yeah, yeah, okay, and so, then, does it have any more numbers after that, um, so what, what was yours, so, up, Right, up, 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 right, down. Right, down, and then... Right. It doesn't work. Oop. Okay. okay, um... Up, right, up. I had to start over too. And then, um... So it's noon, three, noon. What was the rest of yours? Uh, so noon, noon, three, six. Uh, so it wasn't upright up? So upright up, 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 right down. Okay. Up, up. Right down, and that's the end of yours. Okay, uh, right, right, right down. My game just crashed. Oh, oh no, no. Oh, yeah, all good. Oh no, it just, it just turned off the screen, but it's all good, it's back again. Okay. Um, I've got it. Um, I, I got the train on this side. Do you need, um, the path? I, yes, please. So, so okay. what was it? So it was up, right, up, yeah. up, up, right, down, yeah. right, 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 yeah. down, right. And, right. and then down, down, right. Um, yep. There we go. Any other oh. train? And there's the train. Mm. Chapter 3. Oh, the train. It was easier than I thought to extract time from animals. Now I had to learn how to do the same with people. Oh. Amali, that's creepy. I knew Lark wouldn't want to harm the people who went into the clock, so I decided to give them a way out. Mm. From 1932 to 1937. Five years! Oh. See what happened five years later. Ooh. Light Another ball. train track is closed. Uh, I'm clicking light bulbs, and some of the gate has lit up. Okay. Oh. Oh, there's more light bulbs around. Yeah. And there's that little house. Oh, I have a telephone. Yeah, this is an old-fashioned telephone. And it looks like I'll need five numbers. 
And it only has one, two, three, four. Excuse me, an asterisk, a pound sign, and a zero. Is that in the house? I've got a phone too. Oh. So I've got five, six, seven, eight plus uh, uh, squiggly line and uh, nine. Oh, you got the rest of the phone numbers. <laughs> I'm guessing we need to find whatever the number is and then type it in. Ooh, Morse code. There's a little radio thing in the post office. The light bulbs sound nice. Oh! Okay. In my post, I've got three boxes with 44, 46, and 48. Oh, yeah, you can scroll up. Oh, okay. If, if it's like the other one. Oh, yeah, I'm scrolling up. Oh, there's a note. It says, I am so excited to restore the clock shop with you, Lark. So then we are going to be a proper family again. Meet me in the basement of the shop. Why is it always the basement with them? <laughs> okay, the gate's all lit up, but I can't go inside yet. Oh... This, I, I went to the clock shop and it is very dark. I can't, oh, oh, okay, I can go down. Kind of creepy. Ooh, I can go down. Yeah. Um, there seems to be some kind of fuse box. Oh! Uh, it's asking me to click stuff, so... Oh. Uh oh. Do you have buttons on yours or is it just a screen? Oh, it's it's buttons in a screen. It asked me to click the raven and then it I guess it was uh the next part it was asking you to click something. So we got to turn it on at the blank, same blank, time. Blank. Yeah. All right, ready? Yeah. Uh raven. Button to press. Right, you gotta press the snake. Oh, okay. Okay, cause it's does it want me to press the snake? Oh, uh, it turned itself off. Let's turn it again. So. Oh, okay. So I think it first. I'm not bothering you, my grandpa. I don't know what you said. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, cause I'm I'm playing a game online with a friend, so I'm not too loud or anything, am I? I'm sorry. So I woke Grandpa up. <laughs> All right. Okay. Start over again again. Snake, moth, people, hourglass, here, railway puppet, moth, pink wolf, raven, snake, keyhole. Okay. Here. Slither, snake. So gear, okay. Snake. Feather. Um, so that's right. Yes, of oh, the very last. Escape. Keyhole. Oh, keyhole. Oh, man. Once more. <laughs> Maybe. Snake. Moth. Keyhole. Hourglass. Gear. Railway. Puppet. Raven, snake, moth, hourglass, keyhole, hourglass, hill, wave, throwing, puppet, moth, 
equal. Um, that's all right. Which one are you up to? I I keep messing up at different levels. Uh, Raven, snake, moth, keyhole, hourglass, here, railway, puppet, um, moth, snake, snake. wolf, uh, Raven, Raven, here minus three snake, keyhole, keyhole. Year. Yeah. Is this Slither? Snake. Yeah, Slither and Raven. Raven. And then should be Keyhole at the end. Okay. Ooh, we got Southeast and South. I've got Northeast and Northeast. Okay. Okay, that was, that was a long one. <laughs> oh, yeah. leave this room. <laughs> oh! The radio is back. Yeah. Well, let's see what it says. Oh, I think I've got the start of the sentences this time. Yeah. <coughs> so it says, three patients from the nursing home in Hill Bake have vanished in the middle of the night? Yeah. Let's see what's next. The talented Amelie Raven has returned from Switzerland. She is... Determined to reopen and bring back glory to Raven's clocks. The police are looking for anyone who was in the vicinity of the nursing. Home um, yesterday evening. They are asking for assistance finding the missing patients. Post office water damage is repaired and all post boxes are ready. To be used again. There is already a letter in post box 34. Oh. So we gotta open post box 34 with the uh, directions we found. Uh, the tragic nursing home incident has reopened the wound. Uh, sorry, reopened old wounds in our village. We hope these disappearances won't remain unsolved like those five years ago. have no news when train services will return to our village again. The station is now permanently closed. Got one more. Ah. Okay. Clarissa Shah, the generous benefactor of our new cocktail, died last month. At the opening ceremony next week, we will honor her memory. Ooh, things are getting creepy. Yeah, it seems, um, I met uh, uh, Emily is starting to use humans in her experiments. Mm. First it was old people, well first it was, yeah, old, uh, uh, it, was it was first, yeah, animals, now people. So, I'm at box 34, I've put two of, this, of the things on the northeast, northeast corner, what were your ones? Uh, south and southeast. That opens it. Okay. <clears throat> What's inside your box? Um, I didn't get one. I got a... Um... What's it? Morse code. Yeah, I got a thing for Morse code. It says, It feels like I was gone for such a long time, but for all the time I was away, it still felt too short. Too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever. Longer than you could imagine. When you've repeated this message, I'll guide your way. Mm. Maybe we need to repeat that in Morse code or something. Mm. So what's the... How, how, uh, how many times does she say short and long? Let's see. So I was gone for such a, sh a long time, but all the time I was always felt short, short... Long, long. Yeah, that's it. So, long, short, short, long, long. Okay. Oh, there's a second part to it. Okay, that wasn't right. So, long, short, short, long, long, 
Long, short, short, long, long. <gasps> oh! The light bulb lit up. Okay, that... Okay. Okay. No clue, but the Morse code is floating in the air, and the uh, light bulb was flickering in the in that uh, the same as the Morse code. Pete, the message spoke. What does that translate to a Morse code? So it was. Let me see. So long, short, short. Long. I think that's H, I think. It's been a while since the code. Oh! I gotta figure out how to do it on the... The light bulb's in the gate! the other side. Yeah, that's fine. Hmm. So long, short, short, long, long. Long, short, short, long, long. If you go to the telephone house, different numbers will have different sayings. Oh. Okay, um, so we gotta put them in the right order. So how many is that we've just we've organized? Okay, um, so we got Haylark, I'm so glad you finally decided to pick the phone up and leaving. Uh, you so many messages. Wait, I know you're still... but don't hang up on me yet. I really want you to. Uh, know that before I left, I made you something to keep. You company? Huh? Thank you. But I didn't make you company. I would have told you. Um, 
Let's see where is it? Ah, that's not it. That's not the right one either. Earlier, but you never mind. Are you still there? You know your raven that went missing, the one? Um Your name's Cole, I made a new one for you. It's upstairs and it's even better. This one cannot die. I think we got it. Oh, if you press the if you press the phone thing, something happens. Oh, uh, okay, I hear a If you press the what? If you press the the receiver, so once you got your code in, pick up the handle for the phone. Oh, I thought that was just to erase it. There we go. I've got a ladder. I'm kind of scared because remember what happened? What we said was upstairs. Mm. Oh, it's plans for a robot raven. I've got a robot raven here. Is there? Are there numbers? Um, letters. There's a clock. Um, paper. Okay, let me see if I can find the one. I see four and six. Okay. One is the top of the bird's head. With the, the big part and the neck. I've got scrolling letters here. Oh. How do you spell with the raven's name? Is it three letters? Um... Cole. K-O-L. If I put his name in here, he might wake up. Oh. On the clock, clock picture, there's a picture of the raven, robot raven's head, and then also the Morse code. Do, I'll, 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 I'll record what he's saying. Okay. Oh, he's talking? Probably the code for opening the gate. Good thing. That's what Cole says. Oh, I think it's saying, um... Cole's code for the right side and the Morse code buttons code for the left side. It just seems like there's more lights than all the, co the codes. So here I've got Cole facing to the right. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Because he, his eyes light up when it comes to the long things. Ah, oh, so... Long, so maybe he's the long ones are on and the short ones are off. That could that could be good. That could work. Because there's, there's twelve lights on each side. And if that's what he's saying, because his eyes light up whenever he does the long ones. Yeah. Hmm. 
that could be that one. I think, I think, I think you're onto something there. So, was Cole the right or the left? Uh, on the right side. Let's see, so this one's off. This one's on. This one's off. And all on. All on. What was the code on the other one? Uh, okay, for the left, I uh, starting at the top, I got off and two on. Yep. Off and two more on. One on and two off. And the last section is off, on, off. Yep, the gates are opening. Okay, so what's uh, what's Cole's code again? Yeah, so from starting from the top, it's off, on, off. Okay. On, on, on. Okay. Off, off, on. On, on, off. Ooh, I hear bells ringing. And the there that, opens the gate. That, Thank you. <laughs> now that was that was a tricky one. Yeah. Uh, go in and see what's in the house. I have a lantern and some wooden boards, a window, and a ladder I cannot reach. What I've got on this side too. I evidently clicking on the ladder was all I need to do. All those years in Switzerland made it possible for me to finally finish the clockwork. Hmm. My last memory of Locke was a suspicious frown on her face. Uh-oh. Ooh, we're walking up the stairs. What are we going to find? Okay, up the ladder, and I see another room with a window and a ladder. I double-checked Lark's clock. It ran exactly as it should. At first, she didn't want the clock. She said she was tired of my presence. Ooh. Got chills. Yeah. There's some boxes in here, and down goes the ladder. It didn't occur to me that a crack in the clock face would make a difference. Oh no. I held it out to her anyways because I needed her to be with me. Oh, I found some bottles. 10, 11. Oh. What did you find? Yeah, I found bottles too. I got 10, 11, 13, 08, 11, 11, and 180. Yep. Clinky, clinky. Hey. And that comes another ladder. I had spent years collecting time for us, time that would be added to our lives. Never told her that the time was stolen, only that the clock would let us be together forever. Oh. And now uh, here's even more stolen time on this floor. I got 128, 329, 490, 408. 198, 273, 195. Another window and another, another ladder. <laughs> Instead, she disappeared into the clock. I still haven't found her. She closed her hand around the clock and I never saw her again. Oh no. 177, 184, 101, 139. What is it, Georgia? You can't just sit there and cry. You gotta come and tell me what's wrong. Uh, 
Yeah, all the numbered bottles, some of them, I don't know if some of them are painting now or not, but here's an empty bottle. Ooh, I picked it up. Ooh. Oh, they've gone into it. 153. Okay, I put the bottle back. And now it's panning up to the clock. I didn't have to build a way out. I hope you and your friend appreciate it. What? You beat the game. Such a shame to see all the, that time go to waste. <laughs> you have lost 153 minutes of your life. <laughs> it is... Almost two and a half hours? No. Uh, Lark would have added 153 minutes to hers. Oh, so playing the game, we give her our life. Oh, Amali oh, added 153 oh. minutes to hers. Okay, now it's scrolling back up to the main. Oh, it's the credits. It's an interesting game. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm back to the menu. I'm not sure what click and continue would do, though. You still there, Roja? Still here. Oh, okay. On the continue. <laughs> oh, okay. So what's happening? It's back to the um the main thing. Oh, the very beginning, so we can play through again. Why well, that goes back to the tower? It does. Yeah, so it goes back to where we last left it before we walked into the tower. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah. So I guess that'll oh. be it for this video. Um, thank you all for watching, and this is Brushfire and Rojas signing off. <laughs>